Hi, my name's Cheryl Fox and this film is about my current series of paintings called Golden Girls. It's about seven minutes long. The first three or four minutes is about me talking about my intentions and ideas behind the paintings and then the last sort of four to seven minutes is time-lapse video of me making the paintings. So if you get a little bit bored of me waffling on about my ideas, I'm excited about them. You may or may not be. Forward on to four minutes and watch me super speedy motion doing time-lapse video of making the paintings. Um, there's three paintings in the series which are on the wall behind me, which you can see they're almost finished, maybe not quite just yet, they should be finished um, when I show you the end of this film. Um, but I was just going to talk a little bit about my intentions and how I've been working in the series of work. So my first intention was to work bigger. I've been doing lots of work on 30 by 30 centimetre wooden panels and I work in acrylic paint um, and I wanted to size it up a bit. So the panels that you'll see behind me here are 40 by 60 centimetres and that's not huge but it's a next step up. I have done bigger work but um, it just felt like the next step up from what I've been doing at the moment. So my second intention was to work between representational and abstract work. I've been doing playing with both, um, done a lot more representational work and I think I'm still very much along the lines of representational um, with the work that I've got here but I'm playing very much with the backgrounds and I like the idea of the background and the foreground kind of being on different planes but crossing over. Um, I've been really influenced by graffiti art, wall art, where the wall plays a kind of integral part of the work and the piece. So that's kind of the idea that I'm working with there. It's based on pictures and sketches of my daughter, but I didn't want it to be a portrait of my daughter. I have done portraits of her before and really she just is a model for these pieces. She's available, she's here, I know her well, I can sketch her, I can photograph her. So she's a perfect um, model and she's a beautiful girl. Uh, she's 15 years old and so the ideas are actually relating to her and what it's like to be a teenager. She's training to be a dancer, so I was very interested in the ideas of this very strict training and this very disciplined work that she does, and yet actually the chaos of being a teenager, of being 15 years old, of going through your GCSE year, and the kind of interplay of that. So that's what I'm trying to kind of get to through the paintings. Colour palette wise, I was very influenced by, I ran out of print here, um, when I was looking at the kind of size that the image was going to end up and you can see that I'd run out of black ink <laughs> so it came out this kind of orangey colour of the hair and I really like that, I really like that idea of playing with the colour palette a bit, again not making it quite so personal about her um, bringing in a bit more of me and the kind of colours um, that I have, um, making it slightly less representational with the colours um, and playing with a palette, I've been working in a lot of kind of purples and reds and blues, but also bringing in the orange. Um, I quite like strong colour play and colour differences as well. I've called it Golden Girl really um, in relation to the kind of golden hair. Um, I think there's other play and other ideas between Golden Girl kind of being this special child, this child that's doing really well but also that juxtaposition of the reality of what life's like as a kind of maybe someone that seems on the outside to be a golden girl. Um, so I'll show you some footage of me work in progress and how I created them and I hope you enjoy the work. <laughs> 